It's the big question going into UFC 219. The other big question is Khabib Namagamadov and him fighting Edson Barbosa in the co-main event. What kind of Khabib we'll see and where he's at, you know, obviously with his health and in his skill set. I mean, Barbosa's leg kicks are very, very dangerous. But, you know, we all know Khabib is just an amazing wrestler. How do you see this fight playing out? What's your prediction here? Because this could be a very difficult fight for Khabib if things don't play out the way that he wants it to. Well, well, there's no doubt about it. You know, uh, it could be also kind of has a tendency of once he gets into a rhythm, um, he, he he then is just going to be all over you, you know. Um, so it, it's him getting into that rhythm uh, that can be the problem at times. We saw him get rocked against Michael Johnson, who is also a very fast infant, uh, you know, uh, pretty technical striker. Um, but certainly doesn't have the speed of, of probably even Ed, Edson Barbosa and doesn't have uh, the arsenal of someone like Edson Barbosa. For me, for my money, uh, if there's one guy I had to, you know, I had to pick to, sh- to show how to throw a jab, a cross, an uppercut, a kick, all those things, it would be Edson Barbosa. Everything he does is fundamentally perfect. When you add in his speed, when you add in his power, um, this is one of the most explosive strikers and the most technical strikers I've ever seen in the UFC, period. Does he have his weaknesses? Yes. Um, he's a guy that uh, can be rocked on the feet as well. You know, some people criticize his uh, chin. Uh, we saw him get rocked and taken out by Donald Cerrone. Um, uh, he also can be taken down. Uh, we've seen it early on in his career where maybe he was a little bit gun shy and throwing strikes and, and getting taken down. Jamie Varner was able to get a big upset win over him back in the day. He certainly made a uh, big strides since the Jamie Varner fight, of course. So it's, it's the first three minutes where Habib Nurmagomedov has to be very, very careful against Edson Barbosa. If Edson Barbosa can really control the distance uh, and land shots from the outside and counter those level changes with something like a knee or an uppercut, uh, it could be a short night for Habib Nurmagomedov. And, and you got to think all the pressure's on Habib right now. He's a guy who's undefeated. He's a guy who, uh, you know, was supposed to get a title shot way back when, um, you know, had those fights that have been canceled repeatedly against Tony Ferguson. Everyone's been kind of criticizing for not making the weight. And, uh, you know, I think the pressure's on Habib right now. So this is a very dangerous fight. We saw, you know, uh, that kind of take place with Ricardo Lamas taking on someone like Josh Mm. Emmett. Now, Josh Emmett was unranked. Uh, and Edson Barbosa is ranked in the top 10, of course. So a little bit different there, but still a lot of pressure on Habib to get it done. 